Ordering a cup of love Feel it rising up and above You will always keep my heart and soul strong Plant your seeds and watch them grow The light will always know where to go You will always keep my heart and soul strong Welcome to the vlog! We're at Dunkin' Donuts. Hello! Hello! How Hello. are you? I asked you first. <laughs> really mature, saying exactly what I say. We're at Ollie's Journey said this is old. <laughs> Hey guys, I'm going to be making another crock pot meal. I'm going to do this uh, chicken delicious. This is from the Rival crock pot cooking book. I think this book was from 75. I don't remember. I know I had one from 75. I had a, I got a book. Um, yeah, copyright 1975. So this is from 75. Did you know they had crock pots? Was this book really $7.95 back then? Look at those crock pots. Okay, anyway. Um, so, we need four to six whole chicken breast boned in half. I'm doing this in boneless because that's the way to go. Um, and I don't know about y'all, but... Sometimes I rinse my chicken, sometimes I don't. So I'm gonna rinse it off real quick. I also check it for any um, extra like pieces of fat, like right here. You guys can't see me. But there was a big piece of fat on there. We don't want the fat, we don't want extra. Sometimes they have little pieces of bone, like this one does. No, that's fat. What germ? I'm gonna wash it in the dry Okay, hold on. Let me um get this fat off the chicken. We touch raw chicken, so I don't want to touch the refrigerator handle. And I always put my um my meat wrappers after I'm done with my meat. Why? In the freezer. Why? So that they stay in there and they're not stinking in a trash can. And then when we take trash out, Daddy just takes it out. So let's read. It says rinse and pat dry. Well, we didn't pat that dry. Season with lemon juice. How much lemon juice? It doesn't say. So we are just going to squeeze. I know. What? Let's squeeze it. Let's put some three times. Well, I'm just going to put it all over it. Yeah. Let's Ew, there's that. blood on one. Where? Right there. Oh. Okay, so it doesn't tell me how much. I won't use None that. of this really tells me how much, though. So. And then it says salt and pepper. So where's our salt? Can I, can I do the salt? Um, you... If you go get the salt shaker, you can do the salt. It's on the table. Okay. Lemon juice, salt, okay. pepper, celery salt. We don't have celery salt. We are going to use just a little bit of celery seed. Okay. Can you, you put salt all over it? Oh, that's good. That's plenty. Very good. Pepper? Okay. Oh, that's a lot of salt. Okay, pepper? Oh, here, you want to do... You want to use the bottom of that for that? I know. Okay. Okay. Good job, Mama. You know, that guy needs some pepper over here. Okay. And salt. Okay. You can just shake it. It'll come out. Okay. Now we have to there. We have to do a little well, we have to do a little bit of this because I don't well, mama do it because there's not a shaker on it. And I just need just a little bit. Not a lot because we don't have He needs a little more any celery salt. There. Just, add a little celery seed instead mm. okay and paprika it you smells wanna... good you can do it 
Will you let me do it? Okay. Check a little paprika all over it. We're gonna do a little over here. Paprika is one of those ones that doesn't have a lot of flavor, so if you use a lot of it, it's okay. I can smell it. Smells? A place in crock pot, in a medium bowl or pan, mix mushroom soup and celery soup and sherry. <laughs> so we need one can of celery soup, one can of mushroom soup, and we need a third cup of sherry. So let's grab us a bowl and you can do that. Okay. I'm going to keep an eye and make sure no gnats get on our favorite food. Shoot, gnats. What? We keep getting the gnats away so they yes. won't eat our good food. Well, there's no gnats in the house, baby. But I saw one at the window. You did. Well, it's winter time. There's usually not gnats out. They come out in the summer because they like fruit. Let me open these cans. Can I put them in? Here's the mushroom soup. Yeah. I'm so blubbly. Oh, you need a cream of, cream of celery going in the pot. Now we need um, how much sherry? Oh, sherry. Sister's name is Sherry. We need a third. Look on her and make sure she's good. Oh, do you want to smell this? It smells like marker. Is that what marker's <laughs> made of? <laughs> she said it smells like marker. One third cup. Do I pour it? Pour it in here. There. Mm -hmm. Now you gotta mix it all up. Can we do it uh that? There, because I'm scared to touch that because it's on hot. Yeah, I will steer it. Careful. So now, mix mushroom celery with sherry pork over chicken and then sprinkle with Parmesan cheese and then low 8 to 10 hours, high for 4 hours. Serve over hot fluffy rice. We probably won't do that unless I have, okay look up. this over our chicken here. I've got Zumba tonight so we'll be eating probably around 7.30 which is really good because it's 3.30 now. And so. So not touch it. It's not that hot yet baby. So I can touch it? Yeah. I touch it about steaming hot. Well I just turned it on not too long ago. Like just probably two minutes ago. More taste. Good. Silly goose. You're a silly, silly goose. That's what you are. Okay, now. How much cheese? It just says grated. Grated cheese. And yeah, that's what I want. And it also doesn't tell you how much grated cheese to use, so. I'm back. You're back. So I am just going to. You want to have a piece? Can I have a piece? Parmesan. You don't like Parmesan? Mm -mm. That's you put on your spaghetti. Here, move. Hey. Chicken in the pot. So I got 
Hello. Well, they think you're a new kid. They got poop on my deck. Journey wanted to go for a ride on the golf cart, so there they go. Oh, you see my shadow? Oh. Get my white coat all dirty. Giving the ducks some fresh water, and I moved where their <laughs> I moved where their uh, pool was. So there's a lot of good worms under there, and they're just uh, slurping them up. I'm gonna grab my hose real quick. I don't know if I showed this. I don't think I showed this, but look at my crumbs. No. Um, I got my quart mason jars in, I ordered off um, walmart.com. They are like $15 and some change. So that for 12 is an amazing deal because not only do you get the rings, but you get the lids all for like 15 something. So if you haven't ordered yours, I would order them. They also have their pints and they also have their half gallons. I think I'm going to order a thing of the pints and a thing of the half gallons. Um, but I was very disappointed. The bottom ones seem to be okay, although I didn't open the plastic and check them, but there is five of these and I don't have my glasses on, but I don't know if you can see there's a, it's dented. And then there's a dent in the lid. So if you do canning, you don't want that because you want to make sure you have a good seal. And especially like if you're buying something new, you know, you want what you paid for. Although I got them really cheap. Here, let me set you guys right here. <laughs> um, they're like my glasses. I know you're not supposed to use the soap on them, but I do. But they're really, really old glasses. Get off there! I just cleaned that! I'm going to stop it. Oh, y'all are. I just cleaned off the porch. Well, the garden hole is getting all the poop off, so... My chickens are free ranging today. Two of them up there. Get off there. Like there's nothing, there's no reason for you to be, like, there's no reason to be up there. I know how to stop her. Go yell at them. Anyway, um, so yeah, when you do canning, you just, you don't want, you don't want rusty lids, you don't want, you know, dent it up, yeah, you can totally, like that would totally mess up the seal, so. I'm going to, so, so I'm going to see if I can exchange these, if, um, when we were there at our, let me back up so you can see my face, um, when we were at our Walmart, they didn't have any of the quart jars, um, and yeah, it's cracking right there. Let's see, right here, see that? So, you know, some pressure in there, I'm pretty sure that would probably bust. Um, but it was the way, sorry, it was the way that they shipped them. So they shipped them, I'll have to check these ones because these ones might too, right? They shipped them, okay, instead of like, putting them in the box like this they put them both on their side in the box so the box is I don't know where the box is so they both they laid them on their side so this was on the ground so I'll have to check but these I mean these lids look like they might be okay but it was this one this one's got a big one there I'm pretty sure this one had one. 
yeah, this one there. And as you can see, that lid. This one's got a big one here. Don't mind my living room, guys. It's always a mess. Yeah, so that one's messed up. And this one right here. So, I'll have to check this bottom one. But I did also buy some some of 12 um, of the lids. These were like $3.97. I think I showed you guys yesterday. But yeah, anyway, we're getting ready to do school. I got some bread in the oven. Oh yeah, it's a uh, blueberry and then I also put a little bit of like mixed berries on top. So it's going to be even when he's smelling there, but we're going to do school right now and then get ready for Zumba and I'll have to see. I probably will do rice because it's so easy and I think my husband can handle making rice for our chicken dinner. Today is Wednesday. No, today's Thursday. Good job. Today is Thursday, January 11th. Do I give an M for that? No. I did a good job. Listen. So that way we can tie it to a tree. <laughs> Give me. Come on. <gasps> Journey. Be brave. I don't want that. <laughs> So I made some blueberry bread. We're gonna cut into it and see what it tastes like. It's so good. Come on, ladies. On Monday, this parking lot was full. Now, it's empty. We're at Zumba. 
So my husband wanted me to come look at this. Cool. Yeah. This a, he looks a little left field. But. That looks good. Thanks for watching. Hey, tomorrow. Bye, guys.